Good morning. I want to present to you an agenda on what I will present to my teachers as we have a mini professional learning on planning for virtual instruction. I'll first begin with a virtual classroom informative session on um, creating virtual classrooms. I will also show them my very own personal virtual classrooms. Um, within this uh, portion of the uh, professional learning, I would show them a TikTok educator on TikTok that has about five to six videos on how to create a virtual classroom. Very informative. I would leave my teachers with that resource should they decide to create their very own virtual classroom. Then I will move into the virtual platforms. I would give about three minutes to each teacher, three to five minutes for each teacher to um, show their platform that they would be using to uh, navigate their uh, professional learning, their virtual professional learning. For example, in the past, we've used a resource in Fort Worth ISD called It's Learning, um, which was a virtual platform that many campuses used. And so I would give the teachers an opportunity to show how they would plan to use um, whichever virtual platform of their, their choice. Um, rather, the campus has a virtual platform um, initiative where all of their teachers are using one platform or if they have individual uh, platforms that they're using to navigate their virtual learning, I will give the teachers an opportunity to show how they will facilitate their virtual learning uh, for this upcoming academic school year. Some teachers are using the Google platform, uh, Google Classroom. Some teachers may use, uh, as mentioned before, the uh, It's Learning uh, platform. Um, so I would just give the teachers an opportunity to uh, show or discuss which platform they chose to use this year, and if they have uh, any um, of their platform ready to show, I would give them an opportunity to show their uh, neighboring teachers. Um, I would also encourage a partnership. If you find a teacher within your department using the same platform, I would encourage a partnership where you all support one another throughout the year uh, since you all are using the same platform. I would also take a mini uh, since we do have five uh, teachers, um, three of which were, um, yes, three of which were experienced and two we have very new teachers. So I would have a brief moment where I show them um, how to access the curriculum and uh, make sure that they all had access to the curriculum, make sure they all had uh, logins to the curriculum framework. Um, and after that, I would go through a quick unpacking the teak exercise, um, which includes a five minute video on um, unpacking the teak. I would then have us do an activity on unpacking the teak. And then I would have them um, identify learn their learning targets and present them in a, um, uh, slip my mind, a round robin presentation where uh, each group of teachers maybe have them paired into uh, one group of three and, and a group of two and give them an opportunity to um, go through their learning learning targets that they've uh, come up with with uh, with this particular activity each one would have a different learning target so i'll give them an opportunity to present that then we would have a virtual strategies bingo session where um we would compete in a, uh, a bingo activity uh, virtually, and we would have an opportunity to share all of our strategies. We would end with a professional training padlet parking lot where the teachers are given two stars and a wish, two stars on um, two virtual resources they could leave with their uh, colleagues, and then one wish, one thing you wish you had additional training on prior to school starting. And that would conclude my mini instructional professional learning um, activity.